Hi everyone, welcome to your channel, Ochareo. In this video, I'm going to talk about the Odum, Iroso, Osa. That he said that never cry for money, keep your word, and respect the elders. Elegua, Orumila, Ogun, Obatala, and all Oricha speak in this letter. But the most important one is Chango, Cabio Sile, Alafiki Sieco. In this Odum, Obatala was sick. And he has some issues in his house. So he decided to go for divination with Orumila. And he recommend him to do an ebo with the rooster, some sticks and herbs. So Obatala went to the forest. But in his way, he saw Elegua. And Elegua asked him, Baba, what are you doing around here? And he told Elegua everything that Orumila recommend him to do. So Elegua, he offered himself to help Baba to get everything that he needs for the boat. Later around, he saw Ogun and Chango, and the same thing happened. They start to take different steel airs and everything that Obatara needs for his boat. But Osain showed up and told them, what do you do here? Without my permission, you are taking everything that belongs to my kingdom. But they ignore the word of Osain and they continue recollecting everything that they need. So later, they went to Obatala's house. But Obatala was so sick, so he didn't want to do an ebo at that time, and he fell asleep. When he was sleeping, he was dreaming that his house was falling in parts. So he got so afraid and wake up and he decided to go and see Orumila again. So when he was to Orumila's house, Orumila recommend him to feed Elegua, Ogun and Chango with one rooster. And the sticks do an ebo and also with the herbs to prepare the ebo missing. But told him, buy a beautiful bear and give it to Osain because you have some debt with Osain too. And Obatala did like that and everything was good for him again. So this Odum about us that is important when we want to do the above in this Odum because we have some issues in our house to feed Elegua, Ogun, and Chango. But in addition to that, you are supposed to receive or sign. Or sign that I will do sign. You can hang it in any area in your house that this is to protect your house. And something else is to take care of the balance and stability with your family. Because when we have problems in the house, it's not only with the construction of the house. Sometimes we have some abuse with our family members. So try to keep the peace in your house that it will be good for you and your family. Chango, one day he went to visit Orumila and he saw that Orumila had a beautiful lamb and he said, I want that apple. And Orumila refused to that because he liked the apple that was in his house. But Chango got so upset and he left his house. But in his way out, he saw Ogun, and he told Ogun everything that happened with Orumila and told him, you know, help me to cut all the trees that are around and we're going to close the path to his house. Later around, Orumila saw that no one visited him, so he decided to do a reading for himself and he saw this Ogun and automatically he thought about Chango. So he called him and told him, you know what? Take the apple with you. Chango took the apple and with Ogun, they sacrificed the apple and they ate together. So in this Odum, it's important to feed Chango. It's one of the Odum that every single year we are supposed to feed him. No, you don't have to do with a lamb every time. You could do one Gia with a lamb to ha and eta and feed, of course, a leg with you with four legs. And another year you can feed Chango with 
two roosters, for example. But something that you can do in this old one when you do that ceremony, keep the skin of the apple and make like a carpet for Chango. So you put a piece of skin in order that he lives on top of it because in this old one, we are supposed to feed him every single year. So try to keep it that it will be great for you in your life. Something else that we need to know in this old one is that here, Obatala was betrayed by his secretary in his own house. Obatala had the mission that Orofi gave him in the earth to do different bosses in order to keep the peace with the people and pray with them and let everyone know about different prayers. But he sent the bosses with Enini and Enini never did like Obatala said. So at some point he saw that the bosses didn't work. So he went to see the diviner and the diviner told him that he had someone in his house that was betraying him. He didn't know who was because he said it's impossible that Enini do that to me. So he hid in the forest and he gave the a boat to her and he saw how she was eating the ingredients of the boat. And he started to cry because he didn't believe that. Chango, the soul of Batala in that condition, asked him, Baba, what happened with you? And Baba told him everything that happened in his own house. So Erufina cares and kept all the women that was curious in the religion. So when you are working and you have important papers that you want to keep and you are responsible for them, try to lock it out. Don't give it to anyone. Don't send messages with people and even the bosses because this is something that happened in our religion a lot. You give the book for someone that are supposed to go to the river, for example, and when the person left your house, throw the above in the garbage can. So the above, it doesn't go to work. Why? Because the spirit that are waiting for this above never got it. So it's important when you're going to do an above or anything that is important, do by yourself to be sure that everything is good. When we talk about people that betray in your own house, it's not only your house, family member. You need to be careful also in a work with friends that are hanging out with you. This is something that you need to, to analyze your environment because this is the autumn that people for envy or anything else, they could betray you. This autumn told us too that Chango and Ochun they had a relationship, but Ochun she wasn't faithful for Chango because she had another relationship with Ogun and other people. So Chango got angry when he found out about that. So one day she was in Orumila house with others or riches, but Orumila he had some problem in his legs. So he couldn't walk in the proper way at that time. But Chango took advantage that everyone was in the meeting and he got fired to this house. So everyone left the house running, also Ochun. But when she was out of the house, she find out that Orumila wasn't there. So she returned to the house to look for him, but she didn't see him. So she left the house again through the back door and she saw Orumila over there and she said, Baba, I came back looking for you. And Orumila said, you know, everyone talk about you, about your infidelities, that you are uh, women of the street and all of that, but you are the only one that came back to save me. From now, moving forward, you are the only original that can eat with me. So, if you have, for example, cow or two, or you have this autumn, you can talk with you, Babalago, and feed or two with you, Orula. This is a great a book 
in this odum. In addition to that, be careful with the fire in your house because this odum talk about the fire. So always check your kitchen, always check the outlet and all of that. And if you are cooking, be careful too because you can get burned. If you are the child of Chango, be careful because Chango, he likes to mark his kids. So be careful with that. This is something that we need to keep in mind about infidelity. It's important in this autumn to avoid her relationship with someone else. Try to avoid the adultery in this autumn because it could give you some issues and problems with people around you. So be careful with that. Try to, to put some at the muses and a lot the muses to carry a silly, to keep him fresh. This is something that we are supposed to from time to time. And with that, you will be okay. When you feel uncomfortable in your house, sometimes we feel that the energy in our house is a little heavy. So that you can do is to feed or tune in the river with two hands. But when you do that, take water from the river. And when you get to your house, try to buy different or two herbs, like for example, amendra, naranja, verdolaga, caimito, canistel, sweet bears. And with that, you go to prepare an umiero and you going to season it in the path of Ochun. And then clean your house and also take a bath with that umiero that will be good. Cut the hands for Ochun. And when you feel it, take the adjacent to the river. And after that, put some sweet pages for her, and this is something that is a great above for prosperity, balance, and to sweet every single bad energy that we can have in our own house. Thank you, all of you, for joining us. Here you are, another video about the autumn kiloso. Leave your comment below, a like, subscribe to the channel to receive notifications of the new videos. Help?